Hey guys, did you all hear about the British Airway flight that actually went the wrong direction? Well, we'll be talking more on that uh, before we start. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button for my returning subscribers. Thank you guys so, so much. Okay. Wow. Back to British Airways. British Airways of all flights. British Airways. Oh my goodness. I thought they were so good. I can't believe they could make that kind of error. Now, Imagine being a passenger. You're like, oh, I'm going to Edinburgh. I'll be there in about so, so, so time. And then you get on the flight. You just relax. Okay, we'll soon get there. You finally arrive and you hear the announcement saying that, oh, welcome to Scotland. You're like, what? What happened there? How did that happen? You know, did I get on the wrong flight? I'm sure everyone would have been making a lot of noise. Are they saying the wrong thing? Did I get on the wrong flight? Where am I? And actually trying to look through the window. <laughs> Wow, that would have been the shock of their lives. Okay, now besides the passengers, now B British Airways don't seem to know actually what went wrong. They're investigating on it. They said they work with uh, WDL, uh, another company that does the plan and everything and tells you what route to go. And they seem to believe that there's a possibility that the wrong one was given because the same flight the previous day, which was a Sunday, actually went on the journey to Scotland and back. So probably they forgot to change it or somebody, you know, forgot to give the right plan or got the wrong one and just sent it through. Now, another question comes in that didn't they say anything else like uh, while they were boarding, OK, this is a flight to Scotland before traveling or, you, you, you know, they could have said to the patient, yeah, you, everyone's been on the plane. Now, before you leave, they actually say something like, oh, we'll be arriving at so 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 place at this particular time there should be there should have been an announcement or something so that's the that's the really weird part of it didn't they mention it with the passengers all deaf didn't they hear it so it can't be that it's actually until they arrived that they actually knew that something was wrong it should have been mentioned along the trip i believe it should have it should have something's really off here but I hope they come up with the reason why this happened in the end because really something's off. Now, there, there is a positive side to this and a negative side. The negative side is someone's going to get fired for making that kind of mistake, you know, taking a whole crew to the wrong direction and then back delaying them and all. Somebody's going to get fired and uh, too bad for that person. And the positive side is, ooh, somebody's pocket is going to get full because I honestly wish I was on that flight because, <laughs> because the BA said they'll be calling the passengers individually. Now when they say that, all I can hear is they're going to be calling them and compensating them for the error that was made. Oh, if it were me, I'm going to say, oh, I was traumatized by the whole thing. Oh my goodness, I couldn't believe it. I had an appointment that I missed. Oh, it's changed my life. So that the money will continue to go higher and higher. I'd probably call a lawyer to fight my case and get something really big from them. So yeah, I guess it's all win for the passengers. I hope it's all win for them. Um, yeah, that's it. I, ah, I wish I was on that flight. <laughs> Okay, now, that's that about it. Let me know what you thought about it. Do you think it's quite mysterious that they didn't know about it until they finally arrived? Do let me know your thoughts. Tell me in the comment section. And uh, before you go, don't forget to click the subscribe button. And I'll see you for my next video. Bye.